Never underestimate the side dish. If done correctly, they can be better than the main. And in the top of that category is my famous cheesy scalp potatoes cooked on the barbecue and roasted beets. To make these scalp potatoes, I'm starting with russet potato and white onion. Into that, a little bit of melted butter. And you need some really good seasonings here, so a good big pinch of salt and a couple twists of pepper. These scalloped potatoes are great because when they cook on the barbecue and they slowly roast in there, they become nice and creamy. And to help out with that creaminess, I'm using three types of cheese. One is cottage, Parmesan cheese, of course. And I'm saving the last cheese to put on top because when they cook on the barbecue, you want a nice cheesy crust. Heavy cream, you want full fat, no half and half. And then just to finish the last thing, a little bit of rosemary. Rosemary, potatoes, cheese, onions, a barbecue, I'm in heaven. And now you want a good thorough mix of it. There is so much flavor going on in this bowl. It smells heavenly. All right, you need a vessel, and I've made a little tin foil tray. I just put three pieces of foil down and then built some nice sides so it'll hold all the potatoes and you can go right into it. You wanna get half of them in there and push them out to the sides and make them really nice and even. And the sides and the lips of this tray are really important because you don't want anything to leak out. This is where you wanna get your hands in there and really kind of make it nice and level. And I really like cheddar on the top. There's no specific cheese that you need. Whatever's lying around your house, use it. Just to finish, a little bit more parm. How great does that look? Let's go to the queue. So I'm cooking these scalloped potatoes on the barbecue at 300 degrees Fahrenheit, indirect heating. So all the heat from the right-hand side, no heat on the left-hand side where the scalloped potatoes go. Simple. You got a lot of time. Close the lid, let the barbecue work like an oven, let the cheese melt, and get nice and gooey on top. Check this out. That looks amazing. My mom would be so proud. All right, these scalp potatoes need to cool out for just a minute, and I can't wait to tuck in. All right, it's that time to cool. Oh, yes. On the barbecue, too. It's like the best scalloped potato. Lots of cheese with a little bit of rosemary. That dish for me, in my soul, is a time machine to really, really good memories. <laughs>